Good morning guys. Welcome to my morning routine. It is 4.35 in the morning. I don't know why I do this to myself. I can barely open my eyes, but we are going to get our sports bra and leggings on. My morning routine isn't that like crazy complicated, but I'll just share with you like what I do because I get up so early. I just like have everything preset pretty much so I can like run out the door since I don't have that much time because I have to leave at five. So yeah, I wake up. I typically like stay in bed as long as I can and contemplate like, why do I do this to myself again? Um, but it's not too bad getting up this early. You kind of get used to it mm. and I get changed. Okay, so I decided to wear this today. It is just my cycle bar sports bra with black leggings. Pretty simple. And now I throw up my hair and brush my teeth. Then come in here to pack my lunch, which is already pre-packed because I packed it the night before. So all I need to do is put the stuff in the lunch box. So I just have the cold stuff in the bottom because this is actually ice. And then I put some napkins in to just have like a barrier, I don't know. <laughs> And then I put my little saltine crackers and cookies on top with like my vitamins and stuff on top of that. So we're running on time because it's 4.53. I like to pull out of my driveway around 5-ish just because I need to get there. And even though I live pretty far and stuff, like, I don't know, when I leave at that time, it just makes me feel like I'm gonna get there in enough time so I'm not like in a hurry. Also guys, I typically always wear my um, reading glasses because, well they're not reading glasses but they're like everyday glasses, but I typically wear these when I drive just so I can like not use as much energy like trying to see. I know that sounds weird but I think it's true. And then I always pre-pack my clothes in the evening um, before I have to get up this early. So I'm just ready to walk out the door so I have everything. I also have a reminder always at 4.55 to remember to take my lunch because I always seem to forget to take my lunch. So I don't know, it's just nice to have that reminder and I have it. So let's get on the road. And then when I'm driving, I typically listen to podcasts. So as you guys know, like I've been obsessed with and been listening to Gretchen Garrity's um, podcast. And that is what I'm gonna listen to now. I don't know why, I feel like she just like gets me in a good mood, even if I'm like tired or whatnot. Like, I don't know, I just feel like it gets me in a better mood than like listening to music in a way. I feel like, you know, she's in my car just like talking to me like we're just old friends catching up. So yeah, that is what I do when I'm in the car. Sorry that he's kind of loud in here, but um, got 11th in the class. There's a lot of people there, and like, I thought I was doing well, but 
but the overall like class and like stats and everything was really good for me so I think I'm improving which is nice. I now get dressed for work and like I clean up so like I put on deodorant, wash my face and stuff, get myself like a little sponge bath and yeah that's what I'm gonna do now. I'll show you guys my outfit. It's kind of plain but it's fine. So this is the outfit. Um, I was gonna leave this like hanging out but it just literally looks like a pilgrim because I call this my pilgrim shirt because that's what I feel like when I wear it but um, I just decided to tuck it in so it's not too like pilgrimy if you get what I mean so and then I just have um, the back just like hanging out like this and I take down my hair and everything like in the car I just don't want to take it down here it's still like kind of sweaty and stuff Okay, and now comes the time of my dilemma because I'm always like, do I get Starbucks or not? For getting up this early, like, I feel like I always deserve it, to be honest, but um, tomorrow is my 50th ride, so I'll probably end up getting Starbucks tomorrow, but I always tell myself, like, on Thursdays, I'm not going to get Starbucks because uh, it's like Thursday, it's not like that much of a special day, so I don't know. I always end up getting it anyway. So tomorrow I'm probably gonna celebrate with a tall one, but today I'm really thinking that I'm gonna get the grande. Ugh, I don't know guys, like it doesn't kill you, you know what I mean? So, um, also too, side note, I got this really cute disc necklace. It says an A on it, like, well, it just has an A on it. And I love it, it's so cute. It's from Made by Mary and I love it. I wanted a necklace that wouldn't like tarnish. So I'm gonna see how long this one holds up. Um, they say like, oh, you shouldn't wear it like in the shower or like in the pool. But I'm the type of person like for my jewelry, like I do not want to like take it off. So anyway, yeah, I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get a tall today and a tall tomorrow. So it'll like even out. <laughs> so it'll even out the Starbucks fix I have always. So I'm gonna do it. The people like already kind of know me there. At least I think so. I'm not sure. But he was like, oh, see you tomorrow. Like one of the days. And I was like, okay. But I never go to Starbucks on Friday. So uh, vanilla sweet cream cold brew, tall, light ice, caramel drizzle, and then light splash of sweet cream. And I'm just gonna do that. So I don't feel bad when I go tomorrow. And I'm gonna also get another tall. So we are... Oh no, they're all out of caramel drizzle. That's so sad. Maybe I'll try the one like near where I work. <sighs> Maybe that's a sign not to have Starbucks. I don't think I'm gonna have Starbucks today. Mm, but I want it so bad. All right, what I think I'm gonna do, I love how this is like my morning. This is seriously my morning routine. So anyway, we're gonna do this, but I'm gonna get something else. So I think I'm going to do, let me look at my favorites tab. Okay, so that Starbucks that I normally go to is like all out of everything. So I'm gonna go to the one like closer to my work and um, that'll work out well because um, they have everything. Cause the other one was out of almond milk and they were out of caramel. So definitely nothing that I really want there. So I'm gonna go to the other one. And that'll be good because uh, hopefully it'll be like less traffic like going down like this busy road. I typically normally take down my hair after I get out of there just because it's still like sweaty and everything but I want it to have like time to like air out before I put just like a touch of dry shampoo in it so I kind of just leave it looking crazy like this for a little bit um, after my class. So now I'm gonna go to Starbucks because that's part of the normal morning. Well, this is part of the routine like when I get up this early. Okay guys, so I went to the other Starbucks and I got myself a tall. Look how tiny it is. I do this to compromise like so I get a little taste but it's not like the big one, you know what I mean? Well, I mean medium or big so um, just a little taste and then this is when I like catch up on my social media or debate like Oh, after I drink my coffee, like, should I take, like, a half hour nap because I've been up so long? But then again, I'm not even tired right now. Well, I'm a little tired. I don't know. Like, I would rest my eyes. Um, caffeine's never affected me because, like, you're looking at someone who drank Diet Coke for, like, so long that, like, caffeine really doesn't affect me that much, I don't think. 
so this won't like not make me tired so i always debate like do i take a nap after i like just chill out or do i not it's always it always just goes back and forth i'm always in a dilemma when it comes to like what do i do with this time because it's currently like 7 30 and it's already like this bright out so um the time change is coming too so i'm gonna just enjoy the coffee um this is my just normal order the um tall vanilla sweet cream cold brew with caramel drizzle with light sweet cream and um light ice sometimes they overdo the sweet cream so it's like i'd rather have it on the lighter side rather than too much so i just put light so yeah just gonna enjoy this and then after this see what i want to do okay guys so i didn't end up going to sleep but like I just rest my eyes I guess um and then watch TikTok so that's what I did um now my hair is like pretty dry so I'm going to use this miniature dry shampoo and it is the Amika perk up shampoo and I really like this um because it smells good and <laughs> it's like travel size so I just spray this in my hair my hair's clean, but like what I've heard is to use dry shampoo on clean hair to keep it cleaner longer, I guess. Okay, so now the hair is looking good, pretty fresh, and now I just need to put on my perfume. And I just typically use like a sample perfume. It's just like one of these little things because it's easier to carry. I like the smaller ones just because I don't want to carry like a huge like thing in my bag. So just gonna put this on and then I'll be like pretty good to go in. So now I'm all ready for work and I guess that's the end of my morning routine. Um, I typically like go into the building and just get water and my little tumbler thing and then I go to the bathroom and then I'm at my desk for the rest of the day pretty much and then lunch and then I'm done so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this like 4 30 a.m morning routine um this is kind of just what I do I was talking to this lady at cycle bar and she was like it's so cool because like when you think about it you've already accomplished so much before your day even starts and like before a lot of people even like wake up so you should feel like really productive and I totally agree I think that it's really cool and nice to be productive and like know that you've done a lot of stuff before your actual day gets started the hardest part I would say is waking up but once I'm up I'm like I'm up and it's fine but yeah, so again, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.